Greetings, my sexy audience. My name is Marty, and another tournament, another Pick'em Challenge. As you can see, the Katowice, 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 however you want to pronounce it, 2015 ESL1 tournament Pick'em Challenge is up. You can buy the stickers, you can bet them, and as you can see in DreamHack, which was in November, I believe, yeah, in November 2014, I got the gold coin, I got 92 points out of 100. Kind of failed with the silver coin over here at ESL1 Cologne, which was the first Pick'em Challenge there I got 71 points I think so we'll see how it's gonna happen this time so we're gonna go into the watch page and as you can see you can now check every single tournament there was or well oh yeah you can watch older tournament matches because there was no pick'em challenge then you can watch every other tournament the pick'em challenge and you can also see the matches so as you can see you can also see the leaderboards back then so I have only two friends that have the gold coin in the Cologne tournament and then in DreamHack Winter I was number one with 92 points and then again two two people no three people my friend mentality also got the gold coin so yeah now let's go to 2015 ESL1 Katowice I'm, or Katowice Katowice I have no idea how to pronounce it goddamn it I'm just gonna call it ESL1 and as you can see we have 16 teams in four groups so just like last time and unlike last two times when I failed <laughs> both times I finally remember that it's not the, uh, out of these two teams who will win and advance or something like that. It's out of all these four teams in each group who are the two teams that are going to go and get into the quarterfinals. So, with that being said, let's start with Group A. So we have a very interesting group here, and <laughs> without without a single doubt, Fnatic is going to be the number one team to advance. I can guarantee you that Fnatic are ridiculously good. So, make a pick. Fnatic will get in the quarterfinals, there's no denying that. Now the th interesting thing is, who's going to be the third team, or no, the second team? I really want to say Vox Eminor, but not because they're good, but because I just want them. Remember, I'm not Thorin, I'm no analyst, I don't know much about actually the pro scene. I follow it, but I don't like see who is doing good, who's doing bad, who's better to land, and who's, I don't know, been raping recently, or whatever. But I'm going to say that the second team is going to be Na'Vi because Na'Vi are a pretty damn good team in Vox. I wish them luck, but because I, I want to see them in quarters, even though I'm going to pick Na'Vi. But yeah, I don't think they're going to... I don't think Vox will get into the quarters, but we'll see. Make a pick. Na'Vi as the second team in Group A. So now let's take a look at Group C because... Why not? Group C before Group B. Group C is super easy. First off, Nip. There's no denying. I'm a Nip fanboy, that's one thing. But the second thing is, look at this group. CLG and Keed Stars. There's Keed Stars, <laughs> congrats on getting into this tournament. That is a huge deal. You're going to probably make them a lot of money from just stickers, but I don't think they're going to even beat a single team. Maybe they, maybe they have a chance against CLG, but I don't think they can beat Hellraisers and let alone Nip, especially with Alu now in Nip. Holy crap, I think Nip is going to wreck this tournament. Now, the interesting thing is, of course, who's going to be the second second team? Pe a lot of people on Reddit say that CLG has a chance to beat, uh, obviously, Keystars, but also beat Hellraisers, but I don't know. I, I'm, I'm kind of wondering, so... Uh, well, I can make a mistake. Group, like, the first days, where uh, the day where you can make mistakes. That's the only day I made mistakes in the previous tournament. So... I had 92 points out of 100, and that's because I made two mistakes in, in the groups. But let's say Hellraisers. Although I did say Hellraisers last time and I failed with them, but whatever. Hellraisers is going to be my second team. I hope I won't run out of money because, fuck, I don't want to... I don't want to add more funds. Okay, Group B. This is a pretty interesting group. Penta, I, I was pretty surprised how good they did in the last tournament and I want them to do good in this tournament. Same with LGB. I, I like that there's Norwegians now in the tournament and stuff. That's cool. Or Well, they were in the last one as well as Lunar Conspiracy, I believe. Titan, they are the biggest flop ever. They always get into the big tournaments and they always fail into groups. Like the past two tournaments in a row, I believe they got into groups and they failed. Or no, last tournament they were not in the tournament at all, I believe, because, uh, what? I believe, yeah, Kiwi got banned or whatever. And that's why they didn't get into it. And then in the previous uh, tournament, they didn't get out of groups or something like that. But basically, Titan, I don't know. I don't want to, I don't want to put my pick on them. Although I guess I will do that, but definitely Envy. Envy will Envy will get out of the groups because Envy are awesome. For those who don't know, it's XLDLC. They won DreamHack. Whew, second team. I want to go with Penta, but I will go Titan because I like their sticker. So even if they lose, I will have a nice, sweet Titan sticker. So make pick. Uh, 
then we have these four teams. Now this is a really hard group. Three mechs, probably without Alu, they're not going to get far. They do have Nadu, they do have Exardi, but and then I don't know. The really hard choice is these three teams. One is one of them is going to be VP, obviously. Verspro will advance because they have the entire Polish crowd behind them. And they've been pretty, pretty good lately. Also, they have a pretty sticker. But then I want to go Cloud9 because I love Shroud and I love Cloud... I want the Americans to have some, some chances in this tournament. But TSM? I don't know. Well, I'm going to go with Cloud9 literally because I like them. But... Otherwise, yeah, I think TSM will advance. And what do you know, I actually could afford all stickers. I thought I was not going to have enough money, but I, I did it. I did. So yeah, guys, there you have it. These are my picks for the tournament for the group stages. So the ones I'm 99.9% .9 sure are Fnatic, Nip, Envy, Virtus Pro. Teams I'm like 75% sure are Navi and maybe Titan, because I think they can beat both LGB and Penta. And then teams I'm completely not sure and just went YOLO mode is Hellraisers and Cloud9. Let's hope Cloud9 advances. I want them to get into the quarters. I'm tired of them losing all the time. Americans, come on, you can, you can get your shit together. Oh, and it's going to be four days. Holy crap. Usually it was three days. Like, if you go into Dreampack Winter, as you see, three days. And if you go into Cologne... Oh, Cologne was four days as well. Group stage was two days. Are you kidding me? Wait, what? Seriously? Oh wow, okay. Uh oh and you had three points for each day. Oh interesting. But in this tournament you have four points today, eight points in this day. Oh well, yeah, ten points. And that is gonna be the trophy for the winners. And what's gonna be the trophy for the Pick'em challenge? Pick'em rules, they might be over here. Yep, that's the trophy. So if you're going to get the bronze, you're going to get a trophy like that. If you get silver, then that. And if gold, then that. I think I like this more than the DreamHack trophy. I think. But still, nothing beats the trophy from Cologne. That was just beautiful as hell. If you check out that trophy. Like, if you check out the DreamHack one, it's just a little coin. It's It says trophy, but it's so dull and boring. And check out this thing. Holy crap, that's awesome. Now that is a fucking trophy. Anyways guys, my name is Mario. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please be sure to leave a like ring down below and leave your suggestions who is going to advance in the quarter, into the quarterfinals down below. And I will see you in day two after... when is that? March 12th? So, yeah, after two weeks, I guess. I'll see you in the day two video. So, thanks for watching. I'll see you guys later. Peace out.